It's news many in Cuba have waited decades to hear. The White House saying it plans to take the communist-ruled island off the U.S. list of state sponsors of terrorism. That was a surprise announcement President Barack Obama made to Congress on Tuesday in a statement released by the White House. In it, Obama says Cuba's government hasn't provided support for international terrorism for the last six months, and that Cuba has provided assurances it won't support international terrorism in the future. Cuba was added to the list of terrorism sponsors in 1982 when it was aiding Marxist insurgencies in Colombia and elsewhere. Obama and Cuban leader Raúl Castro sat down on Saturday at a regional summit in Panama, the first meeting of its kind between the two nations in nearly 60 years, and the result of nearly two years of secret talks and quiet diplomacy. Tuesday's announcement is one more step closer to restoring diplomatic ties between Washington and Havana. Restoring diplomatic relations is easy enough. It requires little more than the president's agreement. But normalizing overall relations with Cuba could take years.